Hi, I'm Darren Salisbury. I'm Director of Product Development for Mongoose Bicycles. We're out here at Interbike and we're going to check out some of the new stuff. This is the new booter frame. Uh, the booter is our downhill rig, so over eight inches of travel in the rear and we revamped uh, the whole platform from last year's an entirely new frame. We added all new pivot systems in, so we increased the diameter of the axles from 10 millimeter up to 17 millimeter, more robust bearings, very smooth action, and a little bit stiffer. The Kyber is our all-mountain specialist. So this guy has six and a half inches of travel in the rear, same up front with the Marzocchi fork. And this thing came out last year, has a pretty good popularity, and we did some tweaks to it this year. One of the additions we did is a remote adjustable height saddle. So that saddle is, a, the seat post can go up and down five inches and anywhere in between. So you come up to the descents, you can rip it, put the seat down, it comes time to climb again, pop the seat back up and you're going uphill. Also new this year are the wheels from Stan's No Tubes. It's the ZTR Flow Rim, which is an all mountain width of their tubeless ready rim. So you can kit this thing up. We send it out with tubes, but if the rider chooses and they're into it, they can put uh, a tubeless conversion on it. This is the Pinner Freeride Bike. So we got a seven and seven bike here, seven inches travel, front and rear. This bike uses the same forgings and toolings as the downhill bike, so it's just as strong as the downhill bike, but the angles are adjusted so it's a little bit steeper uh, for deep woods free ride, twistier trails, uh, but can still handle some pretty gnarly descents. This is the Tiakali family. This is really the heart of the Mongoose suspension line. Uh, it's what most people, how they like to ride bikes. And this is really for that person, you know, that trail rider who values going up and down probably equally, 50-50 there. The hallmark of this line is the Tiakali Super. This year we added uh, the Kineshock Cobra 900 remote uh, seat post, so you can adjust the seat height on the fly. So lower it a little bit for this sense, put it back up for the climbs. This is our Nugget. Uh, basically we're inspired by all the slope style rippers out there and also guys who like, like bikes like this for maybe mountain cross riding uh, but want a dirt jump at the same time. 100 millimeters of travel in the back end, so just enough to keep bearings under control if you're like on rockier trails. Uh, also if you, you miss your landing, if you're dirt jumping and you miss your landing, gives a little cushion to it. Let's take a look at the Canaan. The Canaan is our uh, cross country weapon. It's named after the very first 24-hour race in uh, West Virginia. And we revamped the whole frame this year. So we're using a brand new tubing, and uh, we call it the EV6. But the, the big story behind it is this tubing is shot peened after it's welded and heat treated. So it kind of hardens the outer skin of the aluminum, relieves the stress in the weld areas, and allows us to use an even lighter tube set. 